Ay. <clears throat> it gives me great joy to be part of these commencement exercises and to receive an honorary doctorate in theology from Catholic Theological Union. I thank the Board of Trustees, the administration, the teaching and non-teaching staff of CTU for this singular honor. And I would like to thank my brother, my cousins, my relatives, you know, who came all the way from Schomburg. <laughs> and Virginia <laughs> to be with us. I receive this honorary doctorate in the name of the Church in the Philippines and of Asia and the many Filipinos who have chosen the United States of America, in particular the Chicago metropolitan area as their second home. I also congratulate CTU on the new certificate program in Asian pastoral theology and ministry that begins with the Summer Institute. You really love Asia. Thank you very much. As I look at you, dear graduates, your families and friends, I recall my graduate studies in theology at the Catholic University of America. I did not choose to study theology. I begged that I be sent to study philosophy. The bishop said no. So I said, let me study mathematics or physics. He said no. I did not choose to study theology. My bishop did. I did not choose the school, Catholic University of America. My bishop sent me there. From the preparation to the completion of my studies, I experienced theology as mission, as an integral part of a life of being sent to witness to Christ wherever I am sent. In the past 33 years as, ordained, as an ordained presbyter, almost 14 years as a bishop, and almost three years as a cardinal, believe it or not, the church has sent me to different worlds, and many worlds have come into my life. In the Philippines and in the Asian context alone, I have entered the fascinating yet ambivalent world of digital technology and social media. The dehumanizing poverty that besets multitudes of people, the horror of typhoons, volcanic eruptions, and earthquakes the havoc left by corruption and injustice, the forced migration and displacement of the victims of poverty, natural calamities, and violence, the trafficking of children, women, and laborers as new slaves, the instrumentalization of religion for political and ideological ends. But I've also seen the world of the mysterious hope and joy of those who have lost everything, the profound faith of those who suffer, the undying love for family, the genuine and sincere smiles on the faces of street children, the friendship between people who profess different faiths, just to name a few. 
a few of those worlds. And as I enter these worlds, theology happens. Theology beckons. For me, it is not so much a theology of mission, but theology as mission. Theology helps the missionary church to discern God's presence, to name God's calling, and to say God in various ways from within these various worlds. Saying God. Mission offers fruitful space for theological studies, but theology is also a fertile locus of mission. Dear graduates, I do not know where God will send you. When I graduated, I had no idea I will be like this. <laughs> but you will definitely be sent, equipped with theological expertise. You just do not earn a degree tonight. You receive a mission. In the name of the recent Christ, go and bear much fruit. Thank you very much. <laughs>